Hello and welcome to the Greenhouse Hoop Bender Comparison, DIY or Buy. The DIY Tubing Bender versus the Bootstrap Farmer Bender, Part 2, Effortless Bending. If you missed Part 1, we discovered that you can DIY your Greenhouse Hoop Bender to save you money. Here in this video, we'll show you another reason why it may be better to DIY your Greenhouse Hoop Bender. Your DIY Tubing Bender will be easier to use. The Bootstrap Farmer says on their website, and I quote, Bend hoops without much effort or time spent, and bend hoops with ease. That may be true, but let's test that claim. I believe it's not as easy as the DIY Tubing Bender. The DIY Tubing Bender requires less of a bending effort and is much easier to use. What does a bootstrap farmer customer says? Well, Shannon wrote on her five-star review on Amazon from August 29, 2018, have some strong hands for this tool. I believe you, Shannon. They even show you that in their product picture. Look at that bender. And look at the strong arms that you need for it. How else do you know that using the Bootstrap Farmer Bender may require a lot of force and effort? They include a redesigned extension pole for additional leverage. Now, let's go outside and check out Skinny Arms McGee. Skinny Arms McGee here. Chances are that I couldn't punch my way out of a paper bag with these arms, but I could easily bend a greenhouse hoop. Sun's out, gun's out. Well, at least the sun is out. If given a choice, wouldn't you want to use an effortless greenhouse hoop bender? The one where no leverage bar or muscles are needed? DIY or buy, which one provides effortless bending? The answer is the DIY tubing bender, where no leverage bar is needed. And if Skinny Arms McGee can bend effortlessly, you can also. Don't just take my word for it. Here is another Bootstrap Farmer Bender customer, the Grow New Plants channel on YouTube. In their recent video, Bending Hoops for My Backyard Greenhouse Part 5, they talk about how they didn't expect the tube bending to use so much effort. No one should struggle to make their greenhouse hoop. This is why it's important for me to share this message and to let you know that you can do it. So if saving money and effortless bending is not enough, let me give you three more reasons why a DIY tubing bender will make your hoop bending and greenhouse construction a more enjoyable experience. It will give you better hoops, consistent, repeatable hoops. It has a super simple bending technique with error-proof bending, and it's 10 times faster. So I hope you join us in our next video, part three, where we try to find out which bender produces a better hoop. If you found value in this video, could you please like and subscribe and leave a comment below? And if you know someone that you think this could help, could you please share it with them? For more information on the practical DIY greenhouse, the DIY tubing bender, or to learn more about us, you can go to resourcefulmechanic.com. All the information we talked about in this video will be below in the show notes. Thank you, and I hope you have a great day on the homestead and in your greenhouse. Bye.